praise the name of the Lord. God bless you in Jesus' mighty name. I'm back again with another fresh word from the Lord today. My name is Samuel E. Molombe. If this is the first time you're seeing me, I'm the man that God is using. Daily, I bring you a fresh word on this platform. And um, I, just, I just pray with you, believe in God for miracles, signs, and wonders on your behalf. Please, kindly join our community by subscribing. And don't forget to ring the notification bell so that you will be updated with our ministry postings. God bless you in Jesus' name. Thank you to all our beloved partners. Thank you to all our members. Thank you so much to everybody who is subscribed on the channel. God bless you amazingly in Jesus' name. The Lord says, now they know. God says, now they know. Actually, I just heard that. Now they know. They know now. And I asked God, what do they know? And the Lord began to tell me about information. Information. Information is so powerful. It's so powerful. What you hear can literally create blessings for you or create curses. What you hear can either take you up or bring you down. But the Lord says, now they know. What does that mean? There's been something you've been hiding from the rest of the world. And God says, now they know. And that, 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 I don't like the sound of that because you must be intentional about what people know about you. Yes, you must be intentional about um, what you let out on social media, what you let out to your friends and everything. Because you don't know the heart of people. You only see their smiles, but you don't see what is in their heart. And sometimes what is on their face does not reflect what is in their heart. Oftentimes I've told us on this platform that Satan is not all-knowing. Only God is omniscience, which means all-knowing. Satan depends on information he gets by gossip. He gets by, you know, yeah, when you tell your friend things, he's there, he listens. Or maybe there are conscious agents that are assigned to you that come to ask you some certain relevant questions and when you begin to respond, what happens is they use that answer to fight you. God is releasing this prophetic word through me to let you know that you have to be careful. You will never outgrow um, 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 being discreet. No, you don't outgrow being discreet. You must be careful. You must deliberately let out what goes out you must be aware of what you you know let out of your circle the people you tell information to must be people who are spiritually mature to pray with you and to give you godly counsels it's very important when somebody proposes to you for you to keep quiet until the date of the wedding it's very important for you to conceal the pregnancy until it cannot be aborted. It's very important for you to keep the joy to yourself until you start working. Unfortunately, that's the life we live in. That's the way it's, it is now. I pray that God will give you the wisdom to know what to say to who. I pray that every agent undercover around your life will be exposed. May you not cry on the wrong shoulder Oof. in the name of jesus i want you to put that on the comment section below i will not cry on the wrong shoulder yeah there are people who offer you their shoulder for you to cry on and before you know <laughs> your, your your stories are the market square because they gave you a shoulder to cry on and then they heard you crying they heard the things you were saying and they took it off to the market square May you not fall in the hands of counterfeit and demonic agents undercover. May you not fall in the hands of uh, uh, information mongers. People who are desperate to get information to feed the kingdom of darkness so that they can torment you. I put a mark on you and it's the mark of God. 
when they see you they flee in jesus name god bless you shalom